Free game? Free game. Brutal Doom. It's like taking old Doom and introducing TRT and HGH and railing a line of high-octane okay. If you ever played Doom, or at least pretended you did, this is the jam. Here's how to do it. Check the description for a bunch of easy links to get started. First, if you don't have 7-Zip, download it and install it right now. Second, go to ZDoom's website and download GZ Doom. Third, grab the Doom Wad wherever those are sold. Fourth and fifth, grab the Brutal Doom Mod, and I recommend the Music Pack because hell yeah. Now you'll want to make a folder and we'll just call it Doom. Go to your Downloads folder and cut and paste or just drag everything and dump it into the Doom folder. Looking good. Now right click on all of your files and go to the 7-zip tab. Extract here all of the files that you downloaded. Now you can just click gzdoom.exe and play Doom. It's actually an upgraded version with fancy looking controls and jumping, but we're here for brutality. Now, if you right click on the file labeled brutalv21.pk3, go down to properties. You see where it says opens with? You'll want it to say GZ Doom, but if it doesn't, click change, then more apps, then look for another app on this PC. Go to wherever your Doom folder we made earlier is and select gzdoom.exe. Now, if you click on brutalv21.pk3, it will open Brutal Doom. If it crashes the first time, don't stress, just close it and reload it. Sometimes computers are stupid. Now, we're not totally done yet. I want you to right click on brutalv21.pk3 one more time, then mouse over Send To, and then click Desktop, Create Shortcut. Now go back to your desktop and right click brutalv21.pk3 and click on Properties. Under the General tab, you can see that you can rename it. I retitled mine Brutal Doom. Now, you could be done here, but if you want to class things up a little bit more, go download a new icon for your shortcut. Make sure to look closely to hover over the choice to download the ICO file. Grab the ICO file you just downloaded out of the Downloads folder and drop that bad boy into your Doom folder for safekeeping. Right click on Brutal Doom, click on the Shortcut tab, and click on Change Icon. Click Browse and find your Doom folder and select the ICO file that you placed in there. And you're ready to rock. How <laughs> that wasn't too hard. Have fun, friendo, and enjoy the brutality. Thank <laughs> you.